All right, y'all, I'm back. Sorry, I had to get the baby together. Hello. Turn up. <laughs> not yet. No, <laughs> like, when not guilty or no indictment comes, definitely turn up. <laughs> All the way up. <laughs> hey, y'all got us. No, I got that. Oh, we got a fight. You might want You might want the you know what I mean? Cover up the I mean, that way, I guess. You want to? I don't have Oh, wait, no. I do have one. I have a... Hi, Penny. All right. I just got it. Y'all should come together like butt teeth. Hello, Brittany. How you doing? How are you? Come on, right after you. Yeah, you know. All right. What's up, y'all? Up and live. Say, everybody say Hi. <laughs> Oh, I haven't even bought a ticket home. I'm definitely planning on staying for longer than the weekend, like two weeks maybe. I wanted to talk to y'all about trying to put together like Ferguson's first general assembly, but I wanted to do that after the weekend because the people who make the decisions from Ferguson should be from Ferguson. You know what I'm saying? So, um, but I thought that like you and Alexis and uh, Shy were like good people to talk to about Kyla, you know what I mean, that organizing that. Um, so, like I said, I'm here for about two weeks anyway. So just, Let's connect about this. Yeah, after the weekend. Yeah, right, I'm okay. Cool. Bella. I'm telling you, Bella. He just magically here. I know. I like him. H.J. Like, H.J. been with Bella all day. I know. All right, y'all. I'm going to go stream for a little bit. So, we're out of here. Appreciate it, love. No peace. No peace. No peace. No justice. No peace. No justice. No peace. So for those of you who've been watching my stream by now, these are very familiar faces that we have all grown to love. And they are still passionately in the street demanding justice for Mike Brown. Fight for me! We got to 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 fight for
I want to help Alexis because her voice sounds so strained and mine is back, but I, I don't want to take it from her. She's definitely leading it on. Thanks, y'all. I don't know what's happening. Do you want to go? All right. How many, I don't want to go with a small group of people. You know what I mean? That's asking for trouble. They need to galvanize people to go. It's not a large enough group to go. That's volatile. They looking to shoot people. <laughs> so people are talking about going down to the south side because the police just killed somebody over there. I'm definitely down with that. I just don't want them to go in small numbers, especially to a very volatile situation where the police may be looking to shoot people. Yes, the police Don't just killed somebody else. Don't shoot! Hands up! Don't shoot! Hands up! Don't shoot! Hands up! Don't shoot! Hands up! Don't shoot! We don't get it! Shut it down! 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 If Mike 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 don't get it! Shut it down! If Marcus 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 don't get it! Shut it down! Marcus said, "Shut it down!" Johnny Bell, Johnny Bell, Johnny Bell. Shut his ass down. We don't get it. Shut it 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 down. No justice. No peace. No justice. No peace. No justice. No peace. No mercy. No peace. I don't know. I don't know many other details except for that. No peace. No justice. No peace. No peace. No mercy. No peace. United we stand! United we fall! 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 All men want democracy, my son! This is what democracy looks like! All men want democracy, my son! This is what democracy looks like! So all men want democracy, my son! This is what democracy looks like! There's way more than 15 people. They're just spread out across the parking lots over there. Ain't no power like the power of people because the power of people is power. Black. 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 Black.
You say power, black power, 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 power. We got to fight back. Chance, what were you saying? A state of emergency? I can't see the entire comment. This is what democracy looks like. Show me what democracy looks like. This is what democracy looks like. Show me what democracy looks like. This is what democracy looks like. Show me what democracy looks like. This is what democracy looks like. Who are we? Mike Brown. Who are we? Mike Brown. Who are we? Mike Brown. Who they kill? Mike Brown. Who are we? Mike Brown. Who are we? Mike Brown. Who are we? Mike Brown. Who is he? Mike Brown. Who is she? Mike Brown. Who is she? Mike Brown. Who are you? Mike Brown. Who are you? Mike Brown. Who are we? Mike Brown. Who am I? Mike Brown. Who am I? Mike Brown. I'll try to tell somebody. Maybe we can look into those. Confirm that. So, Brittany, people on my Twitter feed or my, my chat stream right now are saying that it's unconfirmed, but there's reports that they plan on enacting a state of emergency on Thursday, like they're getting ready for the weekend. I don't know. I mean, it's unconfirmed, so I'll just, I don't know. I, I haven't heard anything yet. I, I've heard that there have been meetings. Okay. Um, there's no meetings. have been meetings in preparation for riots. Okay. That's all I know. That's all I've heard. Okay. Yeah. Okay, so everything is unconfirmed. Okay. Yeah, okay. But don't be surprised. Right, right, right. Okay. Well, there you go, you guys. Mike, don't get it. Shut it down. Mama, don't get it. Shut it down. They don't get it. Shut it down. If we don't get it. Shut it down. If she don't get it. Shut it down. If we don't get it. Shut it down. If I don't get it. Shut it down. If he don't get it. Shut it down. They don't get it. Shut it down. Shut it down. Shut it down. Shut it down. County Brown. Shut it down. St. Louis City. Shut it down. You want some water? <laughs> okay. We love Mike Brown's son right here. Repent, Darren Wilson, kill a cop. You know, I keep trying to let people understand, like, y'all realize that this whole thing is because he's, we're talking about just charging a man with something we know he did. He should already have been paid bail or something. Like he should have had to gone through the ju ju quote unquote judicial process the same way that anybody else would have gone through it. The fact that he has literally gone missing, like where's his bench warrant? Why is he not showing up to his certain court dates? His supporters are quick to throw out, uh, you know, innocent until proven guilty, but how many of all people are gunned down before they're even proven of anything? He's in protective custody. Of course. In protective custody. Of course. In protective custody. The prosecutor's office usually charges Post somebody and then sends things to a grand jury and asks the grand, recommends charges and gets the grand jury to charge. Right. In this case, Bob McCulloch, the prosecutor, refused to do that. Right. And he's done that a few times, but it's not normal for him. So he sent everything to the grand jury, has not recommended charges, has given them possible options, but not said, not had his people say, we think you should charge Darren Wilson with whatever it is, with, you know, even just manslaughter, anything. He's just given them options. I think murder to manslaughter and involuntary manslaughter. It was like any, it was like there was one other thing, right? And, and just, so like, here, just I'll throw it at you. Right. You they just out. dumped all the evidence on the grand jurors. Or the and, evidence that the police claim. Yeah, the evidence, evidence the police have given them. They've right. dumped all of that on the grand jurors and said, you know, figure it out. Charge him with one of these things if you want to. If not, don't. And so, and first they said that when the police investigation, the St. Louis County Police investigation was done, 
their office would recommend charges. The investigation is now, quote, basically done, according to St. Louis County Police, Mm -hmm. but they have not recommended any charges. They're not going to recommend any charges. Right. Bob McCullough, his dad was a cop killed by a black man, which hopefully you all know that. Um, His, what, his mother's a cop, his nephew's a cop. Um, He's on the board of Backstoppers, which raises money for cops who are hurt or killed in the line of duty. He's refused to prosecute cops before. He doesn't want to prosecute a cop. He doesn't want to have his office prosecuted. But isn't that a part of his job? Like, aren't you supposed to... He's supposed to work for the people, even when the people are against the police. Mm -hmm. But he doesn't view it that way. He views his job as to work for the people via the police. The police usually, usually they do work together. I mean, they're supposed to. But he needs to, he should not have done this. He should have let... He should have resigned. No, he should have removed himself from the He's obligated as a lawyer to recuse himself. He really is, as a prosecutor. He should So you think he should be brought up to the bar? I think so. (laughs) The problem is that not anybody can bring him up to the bar. Someone in his office or a defense attorney or a judge would be the one to have to do that. Unless you, regarding this, unless he's prosecuted another case for you, like one of us can't just go file a bar complaint. Um, I mean, you can, but it won't go over well. Um, <laughs> are you, are you guys planning to head down to West Florissant or, or uh, where where the shooting happened? No. Tonight? No, that's like where the shooting well, was tonight. The in shooting South- was right. I was oh, you there mean the for one t- earlier. The one the, just the like one from hour earlier ago. today. Or you no, know? the one that just happened that everybody came up here talking about no, that the no, police just killed in South City. That's in South St. Louis City. The shooting in Ferguson was this afternoon at. 348. And the police shot this no, person? There no, no, they didn't no, shoot there weren't it was any somebody police. It was somebody, somebody shot somebody else. Oh, okay. The police shooting is in South St. Louis City. And that'd be a really long drive for all of us to make today. Yeah, I'm not going to South St. Louis City. Well, my thinking is if it's a really small group that like help, that people going over there is going to be dangerous because it's a volatile situation and their faces are recognized as protesters and they're looking for a reason. So I'm like, as much as I... People going there, like if a few people want to go there, that'd be... They'd probably be fine. South City's not an especially dangerous place. Where's Shaw Boulevard? That's what you were talking about? Yeah, it's in South St. Louis City. Okay. Um, you know, it's not, like, I never feel uncomfortable there. Most people I know don't feel uncomfortable there. But the police are all on edge all over St. Louis anyway. Right. And it's just, I mean, people, if, people always ask us like why we don't protest this thing and that thing and the other thing. And like, well, they said that there was a shooting on Shaw Boulevard, but I don't know. Yeah, no, no, no just, just like 20 minutes, just 20 minutes ago. But West Florissant, like I'm not familiar with this area. Can you guys look and see if you see anything on West Florissant? Um, the shooting on West Florissant was at 3.48 p.m. Okay, that's what the shit you were talking about. Okay. I was, uh, yeah, the gunshots were right outside the office I was in. Right there, and okay. uh, we locked ourselves in the office and called the cops, and they didn't show up, and so. So there's I no reason to go down out. there hours after no. the fact. No, they were there for two they're, hours. They're I filmed them the entire the time they were there. So I left the same uh, time they did. Okay, I will. I will. If anybody's listening to the scanner, could you just let me know if anything's happening? We're getting unconfirmed p- reports about a lot of things, but I actually just spoke to Lee from Bell Support, and she did say that there have been a lot of like rumors about shootings that haven't actually happened. It seems like they're almost even trying to divide the group. Oh, yeah. Um, the, shooting, the shooting Heather was talking about earlier today mm-hmm. on West Florissant did actually happen. Okay. The, police, did. the police confirmed it and the no, news confirmed it. No. Okay. So if you believe they them, no. there you was heard gun. gunshots. And I heard gunshots. The senator's assistant ran her into the office and then he ran to the shoot. He ran to where the shooting was and found the victim. He had to change clothes because of blood. There was a shooting. I saw the ambulance taking the, ambulance taking the man away. It, was, it did and happen. St. Louis Metropolitan Police, the city police, are, they've confirmed that they shot and killed a suspect tonight. They claim he shot at them first. Mm-hmm. Um, so that's confirmed that that happened. That's the one that's on Shaw Boulevard, which is like 35, 40 minutes from here, probably. I don't know. It says Shaw Boulevard is 17 miles away from here, according to... Yeah, that's, uh, that's, what's a, a, good that's way a bit to get of a drive. There. That's farther than St. Charles. St. Charles is like 12 miles from here. That's, that's where well, I come, from. I come in from St. Charles. I'm just that's thinking further you than would where take I have been. Okay. I'm going to go see Seven what the group four. is over there talking about doing because everybody's gotten quiet and went over there to talk about it. So. Thanks, STL gal.
Y'all should see, I got some big ass rain boots. I didn't wear them tonight, but I got my jacket. <laughs> I'm like ready for the weather out here. Hey, what happened to the drum? Yeah, sorry, you do, but you ain't gonna be uh, too much um, chanting after you talk this shit. Oh, okay, that looks like. Yeah, where's the drum? That was an awesome part. I know that when my when my baby's watching the stream and the and the drums play, he gets he starts like getting glued to the stream and then banging on the table or something. He loves the drums. Right Man, I'm telling you. And I'm like, you know, there's a noise ordinance, but the freedom of speech doesn't have a noise ordinance or a time limit or hours of operation. I'm just like, the the drum could have been here. <laughs> what the hell? Look at the pretty puppy. Hi, pretty puppy. Hi, puppy. That's the worst view of the puppy. From the puppy right like, now. That's the I'm right a here. dog person. I, I don't think that dog is a person. Dog. I'm a dog person. It's just a puppy. It's a baby. Is a human being too. I have a dog. She can get her gun. <laughs> All right, so I don't think it doesn't seem like people are getting ready to go anywhere. It just kind of seems like they're here holding the space. You guys remember the vigil? You remember Occupy Oakland and the plaza? It was very important for us to maintain space, if for no other reason that people knew that we weren't sweeping these issues underneath the rug, you know? And so I'm happy that people are still out here. And it galvanizes support, you know what I mean? It definitely increases morale for people to come out and know that people are still supporting them, even if the numbers aren't two and three hundred people, even if it's not a bunch of riot police out here fighting against them. Like, the spirit is amazing. Um, and it's wonderful to see them not get beat down. Where crumbs at? Where crumbs at? Right, jail the shooter, exactly. Damn, that's crazy. Somebody says, do the Ferguson police buy tags before they go hunting on the streets? <laughs> well, it's open season, obviously. I don't know. People just talking, hanging out. I don't want to go shine my bright light in their faces right now. It is my first night back. I'm happy to be back streaming, but I kind of want to give people, you know, their space for a second. Um... Okay, so 45 minutes or, or, or ago, is that the one on Shaw um, Boulevard in St. Louis, STL girl? Well, you guys, I'm going to go ahead and shut down. Um, I'm going to reconnect with people here. I've been gone for a while and not a while, but, you know, in protest life, a week is a long time. You miss a lot. So, like, I want to reconnect with some people here and actually put the camera down. It's a little impersonal. Um, and then I'm going to come back up. Also, the Wi-Fi is really expensive, and um, so I kind of want to give it a break for a little bit just to try to conserve some of it um, because streaming all the time is is really breaking the bank. So um, I'm going to shut down for a little while. I'll be live tweeting. Also, Argus News, uh, if you follow them, they are also live tweeting what's happening right now. And um, as you can see, it's a pretty mellow mood with the crowd. Everybody is standing around chatting. And... Uh, they're kind of deciding what to do. So like I said, I'm gonna go ahead and shut the stream down just for a little while and I'll come back up. Um, I'm probably gonna take some pictures and tweet and do that for a little while. So I love y'all. I don't see any, I don't even see anybody with their streams up. Like, is that, do you guys want me to stay up because there's no stream? Like, I don't know if I'm being mirrored by anyone, but I got like 140 people. Does anybody know, is anybody on the live stream aware of what's going on on West Florida? Yeah, they've been, they've been uh, watching that. Okay, cool, Amazon, I'm going to shut down. Thank you.